welcome, ve welcome to. Is that what you do? We do that on this channel no, we for go. Halloween? Oh no! Okay, we go Matt, I didn't get the memo. We, this we go year. Matt McMuscles in your area. <laughs> uh, hi, it's me, Liam. I'm I'm here. It's also me. I'm here. How are you doing? <laughs> I'm 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 ready for a night of ghosts and goblins. That's oh, what dude, this I'm, franchise is about. I'm right? so excited uh, to enter Maximo 64. Uh, um, hey, Liam. <laughs> yeah. Have you ever played Castlevania 64 before? This is an exciting answer, folks. Wait till uh, you hear it. The answer is no, asterisk. Wow. Uh, the asterisk is while we were setting up the controls in this emulation, I played <laughs> a bit uh, in the first level. And I was uh, away, I was getting some water and I heard him go, wow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's true, actually. I found some stuff that I was very pleased with. Uh, so no, I haven't played this game. I've always wanted to play this game. I always thought it was called Castlevania 64, but the title screen is telling me otherwise, and this simple title grants me comfort. Um, I, we also have in front of us the beautiful Millennium Strategy Guide for the game. You all remember trapped. Millennium? Since I did not play the game, but I did make sure to buy and never read the Strategy Guide all my life. I have many Strategy so, Guides for Turok that remain unused. As they should be. No one wants to play with me. <laughs> so I'm guessing Game Start will get us a new... There we go. Sorry, did you want to play Turok? We're not doing that. No, I'm not. Uh, not now. I'll wait. So I guess Reinhardt's story first. <laughs> and then ca carry second playthrough. I don't know how this game They're, is structured. It's they each have two like I think two exclusive levels for their campaigns, but other than that, they're largely the same. There's ah, different okay. cutscenes and stuff, but yeah, let's just let's just stick with Reinhardt, then see how we feel afterwards. Sure. So this is by Konami's Kobe. Kobe. And you were mentioning you think all they did before this was Rakugaki Kids, right? I think they did some other random puzzle games, but oh, okay. Transylvania. Ooh. Certainly nothing this big though. Century, the province of Wallachia. In this if you've seen the anime, you'll understand some of this. No one yeah, this this vaunted game Egypt. series based on the Netflix anime. Yeah. Don't play the game if you haven't watched the anime. And soon, the land will again be plunged into darkness. The people have returned to the path of wickedness. NFTs, gotcha. That seal their evil Wallachia, just full of crypto. <laughs> Drax Drax Castle, would nuke <laughs> Wallachia <laughs> if they're like crypto. Yeah. <laughs> he, he he looks out the window with his glass of blood, just humming to himself to the moon. <laughs> He's looking up. <laughs> He sees all these crypto farms and all the villages, and he's just like, my Maria would not want this God. to be... Maria? The, the, Annabelle? What's her name? I, I don't know. Drax's wife. I, I just gotta say, the vampire metaphor works so well when you just apply it to crypto. Yeah, it, it is. It works. It's an affront against God or Satan. So here's... Oh, uh, oh nice animation. Jesus will help you. So here... What's his name again? Reinhardt? Reinhardt Schneider. Reinhard Schneider. I've never seen an explanation. I'm sure lore nerds in the comments will know. Whoa! Oh, that's cool. I didn't see that before. I'm sure lore nerds will know how uh, someone named uh, Schneider, like Reinhard Schneider, like not a Belmont, gets... This is the vampire killer that he's using, I believe. Uh, I'm not sure. I guess we'll find out. I, I think I read somewhere that it, that it is. But it's like, how does it... Why is... How is he related to the Belmonts? I don't know. So what you've just seen is basically everything I've seen from the game. <laughs> Roast beef. <laughs> There's some funniness with the controls. Uh, this was their first big uh, 3D title, Definitely. right? Definitely. So like when you jump to grab something, this is something that just does not exist in modern games, but you, you have to hold the button to do the grab. And when you release the button, you let go. Uh, so it's, it was a bit odd to get used to before. But I'm hey. sure they'll, that'll present no platforming problems nope. later on in this in this adventure. Not at all. Uh, he's got the, he's got a crouch and the world's slowest crouch walk. I can do slower. Just in case you... <laughs> Dude, I tried to crouch walk yesterday. I fucking busted out my knee and I cried. Hey, you know, deserved. Uh, and he's what? Got, and he's got this sick slide as it well. It is really slow. It's a little bit too slow as well, but it's pretty cool i will find ways to use it you'll you'll um, find ways to style and the thing that made me audibly gasp was like he, you know he can jump around and stuff of course yeah you can say but from a standing position if you tap left right or down and jump you do a little it, pop. it is handy and it's terrible with the action view but when you're on the is it the normal view i would like to think it's, it's a little view. it's a little better -er. yeah no it's oh. it's centering on him this game also seems to have three different camera behaviors that you have to just 
learn. Oh, by the and... way, there's a fourth one. When you get to a boss, it changes to boss view. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exciting. Yeah. Um, so I see a skeleton on the ground there, so I'm, you I'm growing suspicious. You must have seen lots of footage of this level. Like, uh, and any time you've seen Castlevania 64. Well, only bits and pieces. I have never looked up Castlevania 64 stuff. Well, like, he has breathed his last. A local villager. Did he deserve it? Reinhardt starts making hard judgment calls on yeah. the morality of the villagers. Those are large teeth. We're going to have to stop these oh, skeletons. Oh, yeah, he's coming back. From fighting. Nature is healing. <laughs> skeletons have come back to reclaim what was theirs. Their skin. There is something about any type of creepy game, like your Shadow Men's, or anything that was on the N64, where they're like, oh, we're trying to be creepy on the N64, and it's hard, but there's a charm to it. Yeah, definitely. Oh, hang on. So when game I'm walking on... Over. Can I not move when I'm walking on? I, I, w I wasn't able to when we were testing things out. Oh, that's... I think it's one of those things, unfortunately. That's But there's an auto-lock... Something Welcome like to that. Castlevania 64. Oh, oh, this feels interesting. Oh, wait, I'm not in battle view. Okay, hang on. Oh, that's it. That's it. Yeah. Here we go. Here battle we view. go. We're going to get in there. We're going to... So, Look at that. Someone someone play uh, Nero's <laughs> battle theme. Someone play Devil Trigger because that was some high caliber uh, battle gameplay. Oh, so you can use the knife when you slide, but not the whip. I was kind of just mashing as I slid, and I didn't expect I, anything to come out. I think out. that was a technique that the Belmonts banned. There's no way you can slide and use your whip. It's yeah. impossible. It's too, it's too, it's too risky. After, uh, after Helmet Belmont choked himself on his whip. Helmet Belmont. <laughs> I do like how Schneider has this, uh, this little neckerchief. It's He's very just strider. lying on the ground with the vampire killer around his neck. Is that gonna fall? I don't know. It I'm, was shaking. I'm intrigued though. It was shuddering over. Oh! oh shit! Vampire killers got got some game. bite. Yeah, vampire killer got fist. <laughs> oh my god! Right there's boss view. Oh my god! It is boss view. It's just a giant. Okay. Let me throw a knife. That I missed. He can summon. Let me throw a knife. He can sing. Oh my god! His health bar is big. He's a triple threat. Cash. It'd be really nice if you could just pick things up, like, just by walking into them, especially when a boss is using his gigantic boner bone to just slam into the ground. Yeah, I, gotta, I gotta get in there. You gotta get, you gotta do some damage. I can't believe from boss one, you're like, oh, I gotta do a cool slide. My girlfriend probably won't be watching this LP, oh, but she's I gotta gonna watch the whole thing. <laughs> Backstep slice. Look at that. Okay. Yeah, okay. 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 okay right. We got stuff. There's there's some. Let me, let me stuff. jump and throw some knives. Yeah. 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 Because I was gonna add, when I was saying before this is must be the first level you saw because one thing about Castlevania 64 that I know is that it made for a poor first impression for this area. Was Why the, is that? Was the rest of the game well? <laughs> The rest of the game gets more interesting and like with locations and whatnot and things that it throws at you, but like I, I just um a consensus on the comments from my what happened video was like, yeah, like I would rent this, I'd play the first level, I would not like it, but then, you know, years later I'd go back to it and then I was like, Oh, you know what? It gets more interesting later on, so I I am compelled already, I must say. <gasps> Well, any time there's a franchise where it's his first foray into 3D, it's oh, it's he's he peaced out. Nice, we got him. What a coward! Coward. He was a coward <laughs> in life as well as death. Okay, I gotta say that was fun as hell, though. Okay, <laughs> I'm, I'm, happy. I'm really digging I'm, this. If you're happy, I'm happy. I'm happy. And like skeletons, all at the start, that's fine too. And the knife's a lot quicker, by the way, than the the whip. As long as it's not bats. Or a little, it's not that much quicker. Yeah. <laughs> Don't worry, I can slide away. I want all the skeletons to be seeing you sliding around. They're like, look! He's doing it! <laughs> he stole my money bag! My 500 gold! <laughs> my wife buried me with that. Oh my god, look, that guy's on the ground. That's pretty cool. I mean, that happens in some games, I think. That happens in real life, too. I mean, yeah. That goes um, without there, saying. Yeah, there are definitely... Hmm. I'm trying to think about crawling skeletons in Castlevanias, and I'm not, I'm not sure... Especially in the 2D enemy. ones, I'm not so There's sure white about. Jewel. Oh, oh yes, okay. Save points, absolutely. Handy. Big data save. I thought it was gonna. When it was asking me to save something, I'm like, do I? Is this a bank? Do I have to put away money now? 
Yeah, if, if you didn't notice, uh, you're not whipping uh, hearts out of things in this. It's gems that power your oh, your secondary weapons and stuff. So you can see right. that gem count. Oh, yeah, your I, I caught that when we were going through the manual, actually, yeah. I don't know why, because it's essentially the same thing. Why not just keep hearts, but I don't know. Hey, whatever. <laughs> they, you know, these guys would go back to hearts in Circle of the Moon. Same developers, right? It's true, so, yeah. Um, and uh, I, I don't know what Legacy of Darkness uses. I, don't, I know even less about I, that, except I there's a werewolf. Yeah, so um, I think I might have told you about this like years ago, but like Cornell the Wolf was scheduled oh, to be. There were supposed to be four playable characters in this game. That's crazy. And they, they cut the last two just because we, we can't get the game done in time. Right. So Legacy of Darkness is a prequel that uses a lot of the same environment. So it was like Cornell went through this area first. So is it. Um, I have a question about Legacy of Darkness because mm. I also, again, know precious little about it. I've heard it's both a prequel and a sequel. Is it just a prequel? It's a prequel story-wise, oh, yes. Okay. Okay. But they threw in Schneider and Carrie as secondary playable characters when you finish Cornell's wow, thing. Fun. Sun card. So that's not like the DSS system in Circle of the Moon, is so. it? I don't think so. Moon card. Okay, these seem like unique things. Uh, you could open up the item window and see what the, it says sure. about them. Because I don't know. Powerful magic moves time forward oh. to sunrise. Uh, okay. I forgot there's a day night system. That the the sun something something the curse. What a horrible night to watch Liam and Matt play Castlevania. Oh no! Any night watching us playing Castlevania is a good night. I I have rewatched some of our Castlevania videos and they are all bangers. <laughs> Except for like some of the laments. Uh, lament? The PS2 one. No, help me out here. Was it called PS2 one again? Lament of Innocence. Yeah, Lament of Innocence. Okay. Some of Lament drags a little bit, but that's Lament's fault. <laughs> you, you know what? A lot of people said it's very similar to this. It's like the opening hour or two of, um, uh, not Legacy of Darkness, the other Curse of Darkness, right. is also really rough. Like yeah, people it is. are like, ugh. But I, I, and when I was playing that a few months ago, and I was like, you know, this is bad in the first, you know, 30, 40 minutes. And then by the end of it, just, I was like, you know what? Now, I'm, you know, I, I got some more uh, innocent devils working for me and I don't mind it. It's real repetitive when you just have the axe, especially. It's super yeah, limiting. Yeah, yeah. What even is that guy? Uh, where? Where golem? Thing. I don't where see boy. him, but that's cool. He's gone now. Nice, I nailed him. Where Whoa. boy? Give me that power up. What is it? Oh, power I think up. it's an upgrade to your whip. Oh, am I full? Oh, are those like whip upgrades, like traditional Castlevania whip upgrades? Because they called them power ups. Anyway, it's gone now. Okay. Because if it if it is, then then yes, my whip is probably fully powered up because I picked up two power ups. Oh, I yeah, you, you must have done that real quick. I didn't. See. Oh shit! Oh, what the fuck was that? That's that's. Okay, that's uh. That is a skeleton that's committed. Yeah, definitely. A kamikaze skeleton. I like it. That's so fun. Just sweep the legs and then. Yeah, just sweep the leg. And then sweep the leg, and uh, Schneider. <laughs> Good old Rob Schneider Belmont. <laughs> Okay, so I'm I'm getting accustomed to normal view, but I think I should mix it up. Uh, look inside the game. look inside the things. There's not like an item sit. Okay, oh, they actually have go. reset though. Oh, but there. Okay, they did. Okay. I wasn't sure. So, so I, I pulled that. Oh, it's probably over by that save point from before. I his, think his so because that was a feels game. pretty all right. I think that's paramount to any like yeah. 3D thing, especially if you have the Castlevania name to the jump feel bad. When I was playing Circle of the Moon on the Advanced Collection, I was like, Ugh, this jump, yeah, it feels off. I, I gotta say, one thing I actually really am, am enjoying about the feel of this game is it feels like his torso and his legs are kind of disconnected in the game's logic. And what I mean by that is like you can jump and whip and just keep running when you land. Yeah, I get you. Don't you. Have to I stop. Get you. Like it's. Uh, that's something that Circle of the Moon, I think, gets real wrong. When you land in Circle, you have to follow through with everything you were doing. And that's something that they would... I, I can't remember if they fixed it in Harmony, but Aria, of course, it just cancels out of whatever you were doing. Right, right, right. How could you forget Trying that? Trying to save Bonesy the Skeleton. I wish they would still attack me while I was... Oh, I love know. that. When, like, uh, save animations are the most powerful magic in the game. <laughs> Yeah, I, I can't pick up power-ups anymore, so I assume that's... Be Ooh. Ooh! Nice. I think I got hit by the first skeleton's attack, so I didn't take too much damage from the... Oh, yeah, like you were, like, kind of damage-boosting through the damage. I think so. Watch out! Yeah, that did a lot more damage. Okay, let's be careful of that. Yeah. 
I, I think as soon as you see a blue skeleton, just because it seems like it's it's oh there's one nearby. I know I just can't tell where it is. Just jump around, jump up, jump up, and get down. Up. I think he may have blown up. Cause I it's... think so. Ooh, Ooh, yeah. Let me have that, please. Why can't I pick it up? Is it because you is have the dagger? Enemies. The way he like his torso angles towards enemies and he swings down is really nice too. Can you not switch out weapons if you have the dagger? That makes no sense to me. I'm not, I'm not sure. Oh, there, there you go. So we got the cross swing. <laughs> oh, okay. He didn't. I don't know if you saw it. He didn't do damage when I hit him though. Oh, it, it look, Oh, I just noticed it got much darker. Oh, axe. Let me just try the axe out. Yeah. All right, traditional axe. I mean. Oh, so the secondary attack isn't dagger specific. It's like he just has a knife. Oh, the cross is gone now. It seems. Oh well. I'm, I'm sure the axe is, is a good substitute for how cool the cross is. The axe seems like it would have been good against the, the big skeleton, who is very tall. <laughs> there you go. Oh, yo, man. Wow. They're, they're so mobile, too. That's so cool. That's actually real neat. Nice. That worked out. Do you think that you think that tracked, or you just aimed it really well? I, it, it, I think it, like, aims... I think it does target, like, the position that you... That's another save. ...that your enemy's at. Dead. Could it be someone from the village? No, it's not a save. There, oh, wait, there is, is a save, save in the middle. <laughs> I think I actually just inspected. The only thing is, I'm not sure if I ran past a. Uh, oh, look, there's a that catacomb is open too. Catacomb. Um, I like how they homage this game with the start of Lords of Shadow. Ooh. Very, very similar. Yeah. Just swap out skeletons with werewolves. Oh shit. Okay, this platforming hold A button is. Uh, What's the matter? Nothing. Nothing's the matter. <laughs> Okay, this is great. There has to be some, like, can you not whip these? There you go. Nice. That's pretty disrespectful to the dead, to be fair, but then again... He is a Belmont. He is a Belmont. It's kind of what they do. So... Hang on, hang on. Hang on. Yeah, you, just, you, you can... Let me you just master this, this you jump got this. real quick. Crouch. But there no, it's we go. Good. I Under bury control. me with... But not me, just my <laughs> money. That's pretty good. Yeah, okay, so there is stuff over there, but that's so You're gonna have to platform. I, look, you're gonna want to look down at yeah, some point. Not, yeah, not this side. Um, a lot of people's memories of this game is playing this level and then returning it. What the fuck is wrong with them? No, what I mean is that, like, <laughs> I think it's a little obscure. What you're Like, you're just wandering around, and you think about it, that's like the first Castlevania game that kind of. Well. This did come out after Symphony, so I shouldn't really say that's incredibly inaccurate to say. Never mind. Fuck, was this after Symphony? Like a year after it. That's wild. The Symphony is like 97. This is like 90, yeah, you're right. 99, I yeah, think. You're the start super, of 99. You're super right, actually. I never really thought of it in that context, but that does. Uh, oh, sure so does make things a lot worse. You picked up roast beef, but you actually have to consume it, huh? Oh, hey, okay. And the item list. That's different. That is different. Worse. <laughs> <laughs> I I mean I think there's a value to having the the option you know to to pick it up and save it for later. But, I okay, think that's good. This is how I would do it. I would have a smaller health upgrade that you can get instantly, and then like have a bigger one that you can hoard. But what if you want it to be beef? I know that it's delicious, and ro I have always had a problem with it being called roast beef. Usually it's called roast beef or roast one. chicken. And let me try one. Fifty percent. It's just a chicken Roast leg? beef is 80%. 80%. Wow, so they okay. do have different denominations of beef. <sighs> you hear that little sigh? Uh, I wish he had a munching sound, too. Mm -hmm. Delicious! So I pulled the thing. Oh, here we go. Do some all the... I don't know if you take fall damage in this You do. Thing. I'm you pretty do. sure okay. you do. Oh, maybe or not. not. Maybe not. Okay. Maybe not. Whew. I, I assume that's death. I assume that's death as well. Because Belmont's not the best swimmers. Can't examine this guy. Okay, let's see if I can do it. Hold. Oh, tight. tight. Oh, this tight. looks. This looks. It's tight. Ooh, hey, you know what? It is the grabbing is is working though. Like in this. No, nope. well. <laughs> oh, that sucked. That was a shame. So like, when he when Water. he lands, it seems like he can still take a step if he's got some inertia. Mm. Uh, previously saved. It, so it, just it really wasn't that far back. No, it was not. You had to like press I, one button. I do think I may have left the gold back in there. You remember the... Remember? Remember? 
So at least you can like ignore the other coffin, unless it's random drops. That, that's what I want to see, yeah. So yeah, I guess it's I guess yeah, coffins are, are weak to knives, but not whip. There you yeah. go. See, I learned my lesson there. I crouched and knifed. I I do know that there is a store later that you buy items from a, well, a character. Well, that makes sense. Yeah. Um, I'm going to use that chicken. Chicken. And I'm gonna do a save before I head to the water because clearly water is super dangerous. In this yeah, game. it's anti holy water, so that hurts Belmonts. Oh, I see. That that makes a lot of sense though. <laughs> I was ready. <laughs> I guess Flint still does not have clean water. <laughs> oh. I guess that's where the water is from in this game. It's so deadly. <laughs> Alright, uh, in terms of, like, the... I don't think this game has any exclusive... Like, it has all the classic sub-weapons, but I don't remember ever seeing that there's, like, a brand new one or sure. anything. Sure. There's Holy oh, Water right I want to try that out, though. Absolutely. Why I do, I I do no? like the feel of... Uh, <laughs> I do like the feel of the axe so far, but I would like to try the Holy Water out. Now, I'm sure if I knew exactly where I was jumping, I could just jump you know and just like like that yeah but uh, that that wasn't right <laughs> that was not right <laughs> but i think okay. so i think there is no fall damage so i guess not you can probably except just for, except for when you fall into death yeah that's big damage fortunately this is a very quick little section especially with that safety save done especially if you do if you just jump your way to victory yeah uh, the I'm jump feels good, actually. Like I'm, I'm into it. Oh, and if you don't, if you don't hold the button, you jump lower as well, which is as it should be. Um, I would really be a big fan if someone has made some type of ROM hack that uh, puts Captain N, Simon, Simon Belmont, uh, uh, audio clips over whatever hero you are playing in, in a Castlevania game. I'm, I feel like that's, or at least mod the sprite to look like classic Captain N, Simon Belmont. It's insane how poorly Captain N holds up. Like, it's so bad. It's insane how poorly you hold up. That's fair. <laughs> I like Captain N. I hate Mega Man, to be fair, in that. Like, it's, like, the worst Mega Man. Yeah, Mega Man's is Like, I'd rather, I'd rather see a cartoon interpretation of bad box art Mega Ooh. Man than, like, you know, this weird green... I had yeah, it's just, tobacco it's just so wrong. voice stained Mega Man. If you haven't seen Captain N, I encourage you to Google for some images, and only after that should you Google for some video, because uh, you need to make sure you're ready for that. Do the, you know, the onslaught on your senses? Do you know how many times I've used the clip of Dracula and Captain N going Alucard, you moron, <laughs> and Alucard's like this stupid 90s teen shut up dad I'm, I'm expecting many times is the answer less I like that it saves super quick too that's nice oh, less than on. five Go but down. more than two that's how many that's more times than they use it in the show I don't so. feel skeletons should oh. be able to attack after their head is gone I don't have my power ups anymore for sure you see how long it's taking me to, to kill these guys so it's, ju it's just an, uh, like not a range upgrade it's a yeah. just power upgrade the classic whip power up upgrade I mean, I would ra I'd rather there be a visual difference to your whip as well, like when it becomes like a chain or it extends or whatever. I think it has sparkles. It does? Uh? Powered up. Okay, wow, these guys are taking a long time to kill, though, so... Did you resave? I didn't see. I did, I did. Okay, okay. I also changed sure. to a knife at some point. I, you must have picked it up. Yeah. I mean, that's a thing, like... You, you'd have to have pressed the button to have changed, though, right? To I, yeah, get the item. So. Okay, what do I do okay. in this? Okay. You're, n you're not in battle view, by the way. Oh, that explains that it. That explains it. Okay, like, let's have a running tally. Whenever Liam dies, we're going to be like, oh, he was in the wrong view. It was the wrong view. That's it. If you're not in the correct view, how can you be expected to, like, ace this game? No, you, you're expected to lose when you're in the wrong yeah. view. Yeah. Like, I, am I supposed to have won that platforming Ooh, okay, section if I didn't have battle view on? No, of course not. It's so intimidating. It is. A skeleton buried with a bomb. <laughs> and it jumps out of the ground. Well, the axe is nice and strong. I'm, I'm, I'm it, feeling it, like it's, this it's, is almost endlessly spawning. I think so, too. I was just sort of hoping I would pick up another power up, but hey. Yeah, I know. I get you. I just want to farm that out. Upon those, yeah. Oh, maybe someone, someone is buried. No. 
Can I, can you, oh cool, you can do that. Good, okay. good, good. Give me something. Yeah, All well, right. it's something. So Red Jewels gives you five, okay. I love putting an S on the end. Just let's cover all our bases. Yeah, <laughs> that's game that's game funny. design, folks. <laughs> Ooh, money. No, that's chicken. Roast chicken. I I can tell money and chicken apart. I can. Oh, I can't wait to eat the. Oh no! <laughs> no! Nickels again. <laughs> oh well, I'll just start scooping them into my bowl. That that homes in. That really seems well. to be the way to deal with them when you get when you can see them coming at least. Oh! Whoops! Oh, <laughs> nice! Get fucked! I didn't realize that could happen, but okay. All right. I guess throw an axe at him. The only real solution. Yeah. Sucks to it's so, wasted on like a rando skeleton, but one thing I, I sort of don't like is how when <laughs> when I want to break a lamp, uh, I feel like. If there's other enemies nearby, it, it, it becomes a little challenging because he, he automatically sort of soft locks onto the enemies. Yeah, plus you're, plus it's just generally slower movement yeah. and, and the whip is slow. Yeah. So. Uh, now there was chicken in this one, so I should, actually, I should actually make the effort too. Oh, please let him come in there. Yeah, I was really worried about that. <laughs> it seems like they stop spawning the enemies when you're in those things, though. All right, all right. Excellent. Mm, is that worth it? Let's see. Did I land on like an invisible? Yeah, maybe. Special one. Maybe you can check that out. In the item is thing. there an invisible platform there? Like, I want to walk, I but I don't want to die either. So. I think it's generalized vampire magic. Right. Special one. Special. What is it? <laughs> okay. It can't be used. All right. We don't know what it is, but we know that it's special. Okay. <laughs> Okie dokie. Hey, well, there they are. Nice. There they are. Hang on, I got the knife for this. Don't the worry. Royal Bat Authority. Check it out. I don't know. Power up, they nice. Power up. The, the knife is definitely better for dealing with them. There, there should be a Castlevania game where you can turn into different monsters yourself. Wait, is that it? Route. What, what do you? What else do you need to know? No, fair enough. Like Cornell can turn into a werewolf. Like he has two different modes where he gets like completely different. Like, oh, 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 did you see that with the punch? Where'd he go? Just as I was talking about werewolves, there's this fucking swearwolf right here. Oh my god, he's vicious. Maybe, maybe take a piece of chicken, you're almost dead. Yeah, but you can't do that much damage. Okay, Holy maybe take a piece so. of chicken. I'm just saying. Jesus, he's so mobile. He is. I'm not in battle view. <laughs> <laughs> There's a save there too, so might as well, yeah, hang that's, on. that's as good as healing yourself. <laughs> let me let me safety save here. Will you do a coward save? Yeah. Okay, now I'm did, in battle did you fuck view. Fuck off, or oh there. Oh, oh okay, I'm gonna use chicken now. Actually, I'm gonna use a. Uh, you were uh, right to well, wait. Well, I'm gonna use a chicken because I don't know what refills you in this game. Like if I hit like a, an area said, that refill yeah, me, yeah, I don't know. I, so I'd Saves rather, clearly don't. So. Yeah, so I'd rather try to hold on to the beefs as much Fair as enough. I can. Ah, he's, he's so mobile. He's actually fucking really John cool. Talbane over here. Yeah, yeah. Ah, uh, that sucks. The power up went away. Unless you were Max, which I couldn't tell. This I never felt a tension like this. I'm really this trying to lock on to him, but I don't understand how the lock on works. Like when I lock on, can I not really move? Like I can't move with the stick. I don't know. I, I feel like that lock on button is just kind of like just centers your view. It doesn't actually lock on. Like it's not how it Holy works. Shit, he's so mobile. It's a boss. Oh, that's death. There he goes. Pick that shit up before he dies. I mean, you dropped 200 gold, which I assume Not is worth okay. It. Well, I traded I, a know. chicken for it, right? So Right, that's true. Let's see if there's a... Well, hopefully there's something to make up for this disaster. <laughs> the gigantic skeleton, uh, you know, seven foot ooh, golem. No problem. Whatever. One werewolf. He's so mobile. I'm like ooh, really blown away by how fast he is, you know? Huh! <laughs> 
like the fact that they can jump is here, actually really great. In like, the most sacred of places, you're still <laughs> you're still bullied by by bones. Um, one thing I, I don't actually know is if you are in day or nighttime, and if enemies are tougher. Oh, hey, good, good, uh, good quandary. Your status is good, though. Look at this 2D sprite statue. That's all we know. It's kind of neat. It's very naked. Can't break it, though. Much more naked than most N64 games. That's true. No? It'll tell me how to... Wait! Um, I, got a just... roast, I got a roast chicken, yeah. The it's... lady who blesses and restores. Oh, I wonder if that means you can play as Luigi in this game. 